Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Diamonds and Washi. My name is Katie, and if you are new here, hello and welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing for lots more diamond painting content. And if you are back, as always, welcome back. Today I am here with a sneak peek unboxing of a brand new product from Diamond Art Club. And so thanks to Diamond Art Club for sending this over. This is gonna be a part of a midweek release that's happening uh, this Wednesday, actually. That's Wednesday, November 29th. And um, this is a first round of something that is brand new, something that Diamond Art Club is kind of like testing out and kind of came up with. And uh, they have since shared some updates with me about um, some some changes about how they want to be kind of letting you guys know about what this kit is and so I'll try to I'll try to go into those details and explain it and there will be some info below and I imagine on their social media postings as well uh, so what I have here is this really really cute kit called spaced out and Diamond Art Club recently launched like just just in the past week or two launched their collab their their licensing with peanuts snoopy um there was one in their black friday release that people were really excited about and so i i have a feeling people are going to really be excited about this one <laughs> so um it, this is so you'll see here up here it says an led diy diamond painting kit however and this is really important to note um, diamond art club was doing some testing with the first batch of these that did come in and found that it didn't quite meet the reliability standards that they they want as far as the leds reliably turning on and staying on in the painting and so um what they're going to be doing is really transparently as always trying to let you guys know that this is they're just calling this a pre-framed diamond painting kit for you and there are technically there are leds in there but they just might not work reliably i have to say you guys i do appreciate their transparency and their commitment to a certain standard of quality and consistency of quality and so you know i i, I can't i can't fault them for that whatsoever but i just want to acknowledge that a lot of the packaging that you're going to see and things we're going to look at together which this is new to me i honestly i don't know what it's going to look like when we open this up um you're going to see the LED lights referenced. However, again, Diamond Art Club is planning on marketing these and selling these, and I'm sure pricing these instead as just a standard pre-framed uh, diamond painting kit as well, instead rather. So with that being said, that disclaimer, <laughs> I want to go ahead and take a look at, at the box and what's inside with you guys. So we have what I'm sure is this is kind of the diamond painting of the artwork. Sorry, my lighting is giving this a really fun rainbow effect. Um, we have the artwork here on the front again the name of this one is spaced out and it's 17 by 3 by 17.3 centimeters or four or sorry by inches or 43 by 43 centimeters and of course this is diamond art club um so it's full drill which means there are diamond paintings that cover the entire canvas or surface um, again, this is with an asterisk, you know, it says it glows with a flick of a switch, and you know, we'll, maybe we'll test it later, I'll see kind of what this looks like. And then already framed, that is absolutely still accurate. As far as the rest of the box, um, there's their socials, I didn't know they had Pinterest actually. There's really fun packaging, they have this with a lot of their special licensing agreements, like very Charlie Brown and Peanuts packaging. Um, there is this up at the top that makes me think that this could be sold in a retail store, which is fun. And same thing over here on the side and then on the back so everything you need is included led diy diamond painting kit um so yeah pre-framed adhesive wooden canvas your diamonds your tools um wax tray of course and your built-in switch uh four triple a batteries required not included i'll have to grab some of those if we're going to test this um just to see like i said there it's not that the leds aren't going to be in there it's that diamond art club cannot say that they are reliable enough to market this as the led canvas which is i'm sure is a huge bummer for them too because uh you know this really fun product launching especially i feel like when you look at this like that artwork oh my gosh i love it so here's uh the diamonds that are included and then there are some instructions written out like for how it works here on the back so let's open this up and take a look this shipped in a huge box by itself with lots of padding to protect it which i really appreciate stuck on here Ooh, okay we're upside down hold on a second that is everything there's nothing else left in the box okay so here's the canvas and yeah it's like wrapped if we flip it over okay everything is included in here where's
goodness. Okay. All right, so um, the whole canvas itself seems to have a layer of plastic around it, I'm sure, to protect it. Um, and then the LEDs must be, you know, obviously like between this, you can see, sorry, you can see the reflection in my kitchen there. Um, this board and then the actual frame, which looks like it's, I don't know, maybe a little over a centimeter in, in width. And then there's a switch here that we put batteries in to then flip the switch and then turn on the LEDs. So I don't know, I may, I may try go and grabbing some batteries to see like, I just wonder if they work on this kit with no, no expectations given sort of what we've been told. So let me show you what all was um, included here. So we do have our diamonds, which we will take a look at together um, in just a bit. They included a toolkit and this is actually one of their kind of older toolkits, which, which sometimes comes with their like smaller kits or, you know, their they're really beginner kits and apparently kind of special things like this. Um, and so a project like this, this really all would be fine. Um, there, yeah, there's lots of baggies. <laughs> okay, like not, it's been so long since I've opened a kit with one of these toolkits in it. Um, you're gonna get a pen and a squishy and you're gonna get, and you're gonna get a pair of tweezers. They're quite sharp. And we've got some pink wax. Um, if you were to get kind of a standard diamond painting kit from Diamond Art Club now, they would be there would be a couple of upgrades to it. Uh, but this all, honestly, this will all work totally fine. Um, we do have, there's a thin plastic film there. You want to make sure you peel back before you try to load up your pen. Um, we have a clear plastic tray and then a, a whole bunch of baggies. <laughs> and then I don't know if there's another multi-placer floating in there or if it's just this one. There's also a thin plastic multi-placer if you want to pop that into the end of your pen and try your hand at placing more than one diamond at a time, you totally could. And then we've got this, which just is um, a shorter version of their thank you, thank you pamphlet. <laughs> so thank you for your purchase. Info about the mobile app and um, some other just really quick info, kind of snapshot here on the back as well. Now, if you're watching and you're a beginner and you'd like to find out more about how to diamond paint and how that works, I have a whole playlist for beginners and a diamond painting for beginners video that you're welcome to take a look at. Um, they did include this smaller sticker, which this is a feature on their kits, which uh, I use this in my paper logbook once I start working on a kit. Or you could put it kind of on like the side of the box to help organize your stash. But with this, with this kit, you might really not need to do that. But that is included. And then we have the larger sticker sheet, which they also include with all their kits. Uh, there's the title, Spaced Out by Peanuts. Start date, end date, a spot there. And then a look at the original artwork. And then diamond shape square. 17 by 17 inches, 42.8 by 42.8 centimeters. And then over here is a set of pre-cut stickers. So if you wanted to uh, use these to kind of label whatever storage you put these diamonds into or baggies, you know, whatever that looks like, you can use these kind of as sticker labels and it's really convenient. Uh, the color code you see over here in the right hand column, this is actually the DMC color code system, which comes from the DMC brand of Floss. And with Diamond Art Club's numbering system though, anything under the number 150 is going to be a special kind of diamond called an AB. So we're going to have three of those in this kit. And if you take a look at the end of the color list, sometimes you'll see a number that has a letter at the beginning, like this one has a letter Z. And that'll denote another kind of special drill, in this case, a fairy dust color. 28 colors in total in this kit, so not, not too high of a color count, which is not a bad thing. <laughs> um, as far as the kit itself, it's like I kind of want to take this plastic wrap off to show you, but there's part of me that worries, like, is there another plastic layer over this, like once I cut this open? You know what? That's what these unboxings are for, so that's what I'm going to find out. Okay, and then let's see, oh, there it is. There is a plastic film that goes over the front of the canvas, and when you peel that back, yeah, it feels like their usual, their poured glue. Um, and the symbols that are printed on, wow, this is like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm not used to having to hold a, a canvas like this to show you guys, this is totally new for me too. Um, there are, you know, really clear symbols. These, you know, look like the symbols that we see printed on um, the regular Diamond Art Club canvases. 
so cute. <laughs> I have a feeling that even though this one doesn't come officially with like the LED features, that this is still a really fun and cute image. And Peanuts is really, really popular right now, especially. It feels like it's having a, a, a resurgence or something. And so I think that this is still going to be a really cute and popular kit. Now, there is just like these really fun and cute bursts of like stars throughout the sky. So this actually is what I would consider to be a really confetti heavy kit. That's where there's lots of changes in a small area. <laughs> and this just, it's just starbursts and stars. And it's a really, really pretty pretty look. Now there's a little bit of kind of like line blocking down here or down here is technically an example of color blocking. That's where you have um, a bunch of the same color in a small area. And those areas will go a little bit faster because you can multi-place and you'll have that color in your tray for longer. But um, I also, I was just curious, I was going to measure and see if the measurement that's given is the, I mean, the drill field basically is to the edge of the canvas, but still let's just, let's check. Um, you don't have to necessarily measure for framing purposes because this is pre-framed and it seems really nicely so. Okay, so that's almost 43 centimeters if I'm ed measuring, actually it's a little bit over 43 centimeters. If I'm measuring the entire canvas, just the drill field though, that is more the 42.8 that's advertised. So, But again, this framing, you guys, looks really nice. It's wrapped around like what feels like a really sturdy wood frame and then has this backing on it and there's a uh you know you take this off and you'll have the hook there for displaying which is nice that it's it really is all inclusive um like i said later i'll see about getting some batteries and we'll we'll just we'll take a look okay <laughs> first so let's go ahead and look at the diamonds which came in here so uh the dmc code is going to be printed on the bag which is really handy. And these are square diamonds, like I mentioned earlier. So they'll cover up, you know what, that is really nice for framing because that's gonna cover up the glue completely and not let any, you know, glue be showing through. So, you know, they won't get like dirt and dust and pet hair if you have pets uh, stuck in the glue at all. Lots of these deep colors for the background, I'm sure. And we got some browns and then here's our first special drill you guys 141 is our first ab diamond and ab stands for aurora borealis these are named after the northern lights and have a really pretty rainbowy color shift effect and um that's just gonna be really gorgeous and bold and we will take a look together and see where they're gonna go on the canvas after we look at all the diamond colors though Now we have this strand of colors again. There were just 28, yeah, 28 colors in this canvas. And here is our fairy dust color, our one fairy dust color, Z775. If you look, you guys, these fairy dust drills have a really pretty and subtle glittery coating. It looks like it's just been brushed on the top of the diamonds. And so these have a really pretty shimmery effect. It is more subtle and I really love it. I like it a lot. <laughs> I bet that's going to be in some of the starbursts as well. And then we've got 124. That's our second AB. This is a pink AB. And then we've got 101, just a tiny handful of this one. And that is our blue AB. So again, three ABs, one fairy dust. Now, uh, this, you guys, of course, just by nature, there is no legend printed on the canvas like a standard Diamond Art Club canvas will come with uh, because this is, no, this is ready to hang. Like, this is ready to go. <laughs> um, so you're going to really be relying on this sticker sheet. I think I would probably, like, just to be extra safe, like, either take a picture of it and or scan it and make a copy just so that I sort of had the symbol and the legend, like, an extra copy of that handy so that if I label my storage containers and the label goes missing that I'm not wondering, oh wait, what symbol, what color like does that go with? So anyway, um, we're gonna be looking for the numbers one and two and then the black dot to find our ABs and then the letter E for the fairy dust. So um, Charlie Brown's head has white ABs outlining it as to Snoopy's whole body is white ABs. And then we have some pink ABs right here, some white ABs here. And then there's, hold on a second, letter E. This is our fairy dust, so I wanna make sure I don't miss that. 
Um, we have dots of the white AB here and here, as well as a few of that blue fairy dust here and a few of the blue fairy dust sprinkled through here. The, this starburst is white ABs and this one is fairy dust and the blue AB. There's a sprinkling of blue ABs right there too. And then we have um, some white ABs right here, uh, some blue fairy dust here, some white ABs here and here. And then this big, this big firework up here, white ABs in the center surrounded by pink ABs around it. And then there's a little handful, there's like some blue fairy dust and then some blue fairy dust and blue AB. And um, over here, there's some blue fairy dust and some white AB. So yeah, it's it really is just gonna add some some glitz to the the background in the night sky um I, I think that's gonna look really really pretty and even without the led effect i think the look of that with um just on this background is gonna be really pretty and so cute to display i love that it's got the hanger on it and everything so what i'm gonna i'd like to do now i'm noticing that there's like a little bit of give right here and here i'm just curious i'm like when i go to diamond paint on this is it gonna is it going to give me like the right amount of resistance? Like, how's this going to work? <laughs> What's this going to feel like? Um, and yeah, I mean, it feels sturdy, but it's got like a little bit of give. So I wouldn't like lean on it while you're working or anything like that. Um, yeah, just I'm making observations as we go. <laughs> I'm going to go grab some batteries and maybe try turning off the lights. And we'll see what happens when we flip the switch and see if this one happens to have any LEDs. But I'm just going to reiterate again that this is something they've said that, you know, in testing this first batch when it came in, uh, just found that it didn't quite meet the reliability standards. And so they are considering this a pre-framed kit as opposed to an, a fully functioning LED kit. So um, I will be right back. Okay, so I grabbed some batteries and I'm riding the struggle bus a little bit with popping these in there. Ooh, okay. So I was gonna say, apparently that was in the on position because I saw a light pop right there. Okay, so let's turn off Let's turn off my light and let's see. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so the LEDs seem to be working on this one. Um, I am curious just, you know, what their, what specifically their concerns are, but you can see that that is what it, it is supposed to look like. Um, but I guess they're saying that uh, not, not necessarily all of them will light up or light up consistently. So I don't know if there's any that are missing or anything like that, but you know what? That looks really cute. So <laughs> I'm gonna pop this light back on. Um, yeah, okay, well, so that's kind of how that is, is designed. Uh, and yeah, so I'm just gonna pop this light back off. How cute would that be hanging? Oh my gosh, that's so fun. Now, the other good news, you guys, is that Diamond Art Club is working hard to revise this product and be able to, to bring like a fully functional, reliably functional LED kit uh, and kit line to us. But I think they probably just didn't want us to miss out on what they already have in for us. Uh, so I feel like truly, genuinely, that the fact that this comes as a pre-framed kit is a huge plus. I've seen that very highly requested in the you know in the group and stuff before, um, the Diamond Art Club VIP group before. And so I think this is a really, really cool feature and a really nice product. Um, just with like the really nice wrapping, uh, the fact that it has the hook up here so it's ready to hang. And I think this is gonna be so, so cute. And I think it is totally, totally worth considering getting if you're a Peanuts fan and you like the idea of having something like pre-wrapped, uh, pre-hung and framed, uh, ready to go. So uh, the name of this one, again, this is Spaced Out. It is um, a licensing, part of their licensing agreement with Peanuts. So we're getting these cute little like Snoopy and Charlie Brown kits now. And uh, this is gonna be coming out tomorrow, which is Wednesday, November 29th. I have to double check on the release time for that. So I'm gonna include that down in the description box below. I think it's usually 9 a.m. Pacific, 12 p.m. Eastern, and that it's the same time for everyone for these Wednesday releases, but I will double check and I'll add a note in the description box below this video. So anyway, you guys, I hope you liked getting to see a sneak peek of this new kit. And um, I'd love to hear from you below. Are you excited about a new product offering from Diamond Art Club? Is this something that you might try to get your hands on? I know that there's at least enough, one other that I think is planned to release as well. Um, but yeah, so you guys, thanks so much for watching. I hope that you'll consider subscribing if you wanna stay up to date with 
lots more diamond painting content for me. But I'm going to go ahead and let you go. I hope you have a day and a week that is as amazing as you are. And I'll chat with you in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.